right now I'm going to show you guys what I am going to bring to the hospital with me. Um, it's just all here because I was going to bring a different bag and then I realized that it's not all my stuff is going to fit. I was going to bring this bag. It's JJ Cole. We bought it from Baby Bunting but it's a nappy bag and it doesn't fit all of my stuff and iron stuff that I need. So I'm just going to bring my um, travel suitcase with a hand carry size one to the hospital with me so it's easier. And yeah, so these, I'm just going to show you guys what I'm going to bring. Mostly, most of the stuff that I'm going to bring are just the ones that my hospital recommended I bring. I don't want to overpack. But obviously I have some extra stuff. But yeah, so this isn't all. It's pretty much 98% done, but I'm going to show you guys anyways because close enough, right? So the first thing, obviously nappies. So these are um, Huggies nappies. This is a sample nappy that I got and this is um for me for when after i have iron so yeah and i also have this other pack that i bought just in case because you never know right so that's that and also for me i just have my undies here and then I have socks just in case I get cold and I'm bringing slippers which are the ones that I have on my feet right now they're just slip on ones so it's easy for me and I'm also bringing a towel I'm sure the hospital will have towels but just in case and I like using my own towels anyways and this is how small my toiletry bag is. I'll show you guys what's in here. So I just have a disinfectant wipe. I also have my um, alcohol swabs kind of thing. I have a toothbrush in here. I have another toothbrush and toothpaste. And I obviously have um, conditioner, conditioner, shampoo, and moisturizer on here. And another soap. And I also have this hairbrush, even though I don't really brush my hair. But, you know, just in case. So that is my toiletry bag. Also, I will be bringing this Philippine Airlines bag with me. It has all my makeup in it. This is the makeup that I use every day. So it's just in this little pouch. So it's easy to carry and I can just grab it when I need to go to the hospital and all of that. So that's all. I'm also bringing these other clothes that I'm going to bring. I think I'm going to pack a bit more just in case. But this is just a whole like a dress that I can slip on. This pink one is also a dress. And this is like a pajama set with a long pants and a jacket. Because I don't want to be cold in the hospital. And yeah, so this is also for me. I labeled this bra and nursing pads. So these white things are not other nursing pads. And I have two nursing or maternity bras in there. I think it's nursing bras that I have in here. I have two. Yeah, also this is for baby. I'm bringing his um, bath towels just in case. So these are two bath towels, 
This are like blanket slash swaddles. These are multi-purpose things, so I don't have to take as many stuff with me. And this is just like a plain swaddle. I labeled everything just so it's easier for, you know, my family members to get stuff for me after when I'll be, I think I'll be a bit cranky, you know. And also, this is a thick blanket for baby. So he doesn't get cold. Just in case. And last but not the least are baby clothes. So the hospital instructed me to bring well, this is on there. Five singlets. So these are five of his singlets. Luckily it all fits into this one sandwich bag size. We see all the bags. So there's one, two, three, four, five outfits in there. They're all, this one is the smallest one and this one is the biggest one because I don't really know how big he's going to be. So I would recommend bringing different size ones. And these are his outfits. So my warm outfit number one, this is Hopefully what he will wear as soon as he comes out or when we take him home. So this is my preferred outfit as you can see, it's number one. And it's just like a koala. I have his um, bodysuit in there and the hat that comes with it. Outfit number two, the bodysuit, hat and the mittens and then outfit number three which is this is for like a small baby i don't know how big my baby's gonna be from my last scan he was on the smaller side so i just have the small one just in case so yeah bodysuit and then his hat is there and number four so he has a sock, he has a hat, and then yes, I do. this is like a separate top and a separate bottom, but yeah. Outfit number five is, yeah, this is his bodysuit, a mitten, and a sock. And then this one is... This is like a, I think this is a zero to three month old one. I'm bringing this just in case, or maybe six, three to six month old. I'm bringing this just in case his like the gigantic baby, which I doubt it, but it's coming with me just in case. So that was all the stuff that I'm going to bring. I also still need to pack other things like cameras, which I have yet to charge and buy lollies with me because believe it or not, it's part of my packing list from the hospital. Glucose sweets and cold juice. So yeah, that was it for my hospital bag guys. I hope you enjoy watching that. It's pretty straightforward for me because I want to take as minimal things as possible to the hospital and yeah so I hope you guys enjoy watching this video and don't forget to like and subscribe bye